This local sports report is brought to you by M&T Printing, offering banners, brochures, business cards, and more. Check out their website for a wide range of printed products at mtprint.com. District 10 football on Friday afternoon in Guelph. The Bishop McDonnell Celtics looking for their first victory of the season. The Celtics battling the Guelph Collegiate Gales at Eastview Park. First possession for the Celtics. It's a handoff to Ralph DeBell and it's a solid run from DeBell. He breaks a tackle and takes the ball into the red zone. That led to a field goal. 3-0 Bishop Mack and the Celtics ground game getting it done early. This time it's Mason Visentine with a good run here. He gets the ball inside the 10-yard line. Out comes the field goal unit. Martina Ver steps up and she boots it through. Ver with two field goals in the first quarter. She gives the Celtics a 6-0 advantage. Later, the Gales with the ball deep in their own end. Look out! The ball is on the grass. Jackson Lashuk recovers it for a Celtics touchdown. Lashuk with a heads-up play, pouncing on it. 13-0 Celtics after one. Second quarter now, BMAC appears to be punting it away, but it's a fake. Charles Trollope keeps it, and he's got a first down. The Celtics on the move, but a few plays later, this pass is intercepted by Keon Robinson. It's a huge play on defense from Robinson. The Celtics drive is over after the INT. Out comes the Gales offense, and it's a trick play. Reverse to Matt Robinson, but there is Jackson LeShook. He isn't fooled. He makes the tackle for the Celtics. Still in the second, handoff to Mason Visentine. He goes up the middle, and another nice run from Visentine. The Celtics looking to strike before the half is over, and a few plays later, it's a direct snap to Jack Shoniker, and he takes it in for a touchdown. Shoniker giving Bishop Mack a 20-point lead at the break. Third quarter now, Guelph Collegiate trying to get something going. Jacob Henning with the catch on the near side, and he gets the ball into Celtics territory. Then it's Keon Robinson with a catch and run. He is battling, and he picks up a first down. Robinson had a solid afternoon for the Gales. Same series. The Celtics bringing pressure. Jackson LeShook jumps on it, and he recovers the fumble. Another huge play for LeShook for the Celtics. Still in the third, here's a couple of terrific catches from GC. First it's Ewan Helwig with the reception for the Gales. He makes the grab for a first down. Then it's a spectacular catch from Keon Robinson. Hey Keon, go up and get it. How nice is that play? GCVI though, still trailing by 20 as we move to the fourth. The pass is tipped and it's picked off by Daniel Charbonneau. He reaches down and intercepts it for Bishop McDonnell and we end this video with a shout out to Martina Vare. She was clutch all day long. Vare finished with three field goals and two extra points in the ball game. She had almost half of the Celtics points with 11 and it's Bishop Mack picking up the victory. They take it by a final score of 23-0 on Friday afternoon in District 10 football. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.